Hi everyone, my name is Mimi and welcome to my very first own Photoshop tutorial. So there are a lot of methods how to do this on Photoshop you guys, but I believe this one is the easiest as long as you follow my instructions or the thing that I'm showing on your screen right now. So let's go ahead and get to the lesson. I'm gonna give you guys two examples right here. We have a long dark hair and a short light hair so you guys can see. How is it going to turn out? So first things first, we need to do is go to your paintbrush tool. If you guys can see a brush tool right here, just right click it and then click brush tool. And then next one that we need to do is go right here and click this quick mask mode. And make sure that the squares right here, the black is on the top and the white one is on the bottom. Now we're just going to zoom in onto the picture. Now here comes the tricky part. Okay, um, we are going to basically just mask the part where the hair is where we're gonna color it and change the hair color and just carefully mask it but don't be afraid if you get like smudges on the side like that because the easiest way to remove those is you go back here where the black and white boxes are and just click this arrow right here and then they're gonna exchange and now what you want to do is just delete those easy right Okay, so first to continue, we need to put back the black one on the top and the white one on the bottom. So, just color all the part of the hair. For us to do this quicker, we can change the brush size into a bigger one. And just keep on coloring this. Now, you're gonna need a lot of patience for this because these little hairs right here, they're separated. And uh, that's a tricky part. So I'm just gonna, just gonna do this for the sake of this tutorial. Obviously, if you want this perfect, you're going to need to invest a lot of time doing this. And there we go. I hope that's okay. Um, I'm just going to delete some of here. 8.01 p.m. Alright, so I'm just going to leave it like that. I'm just doing this for the sake of the tutorial. Now, what you want to do next is unclick the quick mask mode right here. Just unclick that. Okay, now what you want to do guys is go to select, go to inverse, and then go to layer, new fill layer, go to solid color. Right here in the mode, you want to go ahead and click that, go to soft light, press OK. And now this color picker is going to show up and this is the part where we get to pick what kind of hair color that we want. So, it looks pretty natural, right? I mean, look at that, we can turn her into a redhead. Or if you want her hair blue or purpley, or you want it green, or you want it yellow, like blonde, ash blonde, something like that. So that's how easy it is, you guys. And let's go ahead and try to do that on the light hair. Now this one, this one is pretty easy because if you have light hair, the more nicer the bright colors look like on your hair I guess or the easier bright colors is gonna color your hair so <laughs> I'm just doing this once again just masking it with our quick mask mode and just doing this carefully once again if you get smudges on the sides or anywhere what you want to do is go back here click this arrow make sure that the white one is on the top and then just erase those. There we go. Okay, now unclick quick mask mode, go to select, click inverse, layer, new fill layer, solid color, mode, soft light, and then press OK. Now, there we go, her hair got darker. <laughs> But it looks pretty nice if you're gonna go with bright light colors like this one, like neon pink or that aqua color bluish. I don't know. It looks like a cotton candy. Your hair looks like a cotton candy, which is really nice. Um, so you can just play around with those. So that's how easy it is, you guys. If this video helped you, please leave a like. So I'll see you guys on my next video. Thank you for watching. Bye!